of an outdoor shower. And I thought, if you're taking a shower outside, you're either super rich or busted poor. It's not a middle class thing. You're either at the pool, you know, you got the tennis court, the pool cabana in the back, and the outdoor kitchen, you're taking a shower out there, or you're in the front yard and it's dirt, and you're standing in a tub with a busted hose, right? So this is stuff that rich people and poor people have in common, but not the middle class. I, I wrote some of these down. All right, let's see. You drive a car make that no longer exists. You're either Jay Leno in a Duesenberg, or you're my stepdad John in a 74 AMC Matador. When you go into a fancy department store, Somebody who works at the department store runs toward you yelling, may I help you? <laughs> You're on a first name basis with a judge. <laughs> Will they either see him at the golf club or you're fucking in front of him for the fifth time this month, right? You know the going rate for copper. <laughs> Not a middle class situation there. You're severely impacted by the raising of the minimum wage. Well, either you own 25 Taco Bells, or you work at one Taco Bell. But either way, you are impacted. You used to live on a plantation. <laughs> Not a middle class thing. You have your own fragrance. <laughs> well, either Johnny Depp or the guy who smells like piss in Timberella. So. You had your bachelor party in Mexico. Well, you either went to Puerto Vallarta where you live in Mexico. I think that's what I'm saying. <laughs> At your funeral, your coffin was pulled by a horse. <laughs> Starred in Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. You know, we're worried about Alex Winter over here, people. Yeah, he's just doing well for himself. That's all. That's all that is. All right. Last but not least. Oh, no, I got one more. Look, I got a couple. You have a refrigerator in your yard. Either a beautiful outdoor kitchen or it's on the front lawn and the raccoons fucking in it. You spend time on a ladder that has wheels on the bottom. Now, it's either your beautiful mahogany library or your palatial estate, or you work at a Home Depot. <laughs> and last but not least, you live next door to a rapper. <laughs> either in Malibu with Jay-Z and Beyonce, or you're in Van Nuys, California, in a shitty apartment, and there's a 14-year-old kid who lives next door, who's busting out the feeds, who goes by the name of Mayonnaise. 